Here come the Marines, and I'm out of position. Good morning. It is Tuesday and it's 9.30 and believe it or not, Marine One took off on time. I mean, and look at this weather. Yeah, they actually came in in this weather and took off on time, which kind of surprised me. I thought we were going to get a motorcade. Anyway, uh, it's raining. We're going to have to find something to do today that doesn't get us that wet, but yeah, we'll try. There's always somewhere to go in DC. All right, let's go explore. Okay guys, it's uh, one o'clock and the market has opened, but will there be donuts? Let's go look. All oh, this happy Christmas music. How could it be happy Christmas music if there's no donuts? We'll find out. Maybe the music is sending us a signal. Maybe it's all just a lie. I smell donuts. I smell them. <gasps> Victory! Hey, how you doing? I'm good, how are you? Uh, let's have 18. Sure. Actually, you know what? No, let's, let's do it bigger. Let's do 36. 36? Sorry. It's okay. I'll feed the kids. <laughs> we have enough to make 36 to make 18. <laughs> Do 
So good. So good. Okay, so a little detour. My wife isn't feeling well, so I, I dropped the donuts off with her. Maybe that'll make her feel a little better. I'm gonna go back down to the White House. I'm gonna go explore. The weather's getting a little bit better. Let's go maybe check out the Christmas trees. Uh, but first, let's get some lunch. You know, we gotta finish off those donuts with some real food. Okay guys, so we're back downtown. We're gonna take a look over at the White House, just wander about a little bit. I should probably know today is December 6th, and you know what that means? It means it's one month since I've had a Diet Coke. Yeah, one whole month. Boy, this has sucked. <laughs> so these are all the motor pole cars. Some of these are actually used for like family transport, like the First Lady. In fact, that might actually be the First Lady's limo right there. She has to go out to teach at a community college in Virginia uh, a couple times a week. And she goes with a little bit of a motorcade. Well, these trees have still got some color left in them, don't they? Well, looks like the Uyghurs are out here protesting against China. Who else do we have protesting? Eh, not many. Pretty quiet. Nobody wants to protest in the rain, I guess. Must be some event. They've got a tent set up over here uh, next to the presidential townhouse. Hmm. Maybe a Christmas event of some sort. Oh, we got a motorcycle cop coming down the street. Oh, sounds like there is a big group up there. Protest at the Chamber of Commerce. Yeah, we'll go check that out in a bit. Uh, not much at the White House. A couple of cars coming out, Secret Service. And the Truth Conductor's out here. He's got an umbrella. The uh, Christmas ornaments are still in the fountain. Right over here. <coughs> and the wreath is up across above the north portico. Somebody was asking me the other day that they don't see much activity out here at the north portico. And that's true. There's not a lot of activity at the north portico. And this is what you can see from the webcam. But over there is the west wing. And, well, there's quite a bit of activity over there. I see people all the time. Let's uh, swing past this guy. And let's go see what they're protesting at the Chamber of Commerce. Probably a union thing or something like that. 
Yeah. Credit. Among other things that family needs. Instead, they chose to protect runaway profits for corporations. Yes. And we want the payments monthly. Yes. People use those payments. They paid their rent, they bought clothes, they bought food. They didn't squander that money. They used that money to take care of themselves. Who you asked me about the trees? Yeah, there are trees that have lost their leaves because it is winter, but then there are other types of trees that are more evergreen in nature, including some of these right over here in Lafayette Park. And they still have very colorful leaves, offering a lot of cover. Now at the White House, there are some trees out by the fence line that have lost their leaves, but the ones closer in, they tended to plant evergreens, probably mostly for security reasons, to keep some uh, foliage covering up certain windows and whatnot. Let's go wander over there. What do we got? Are these the cops for the protest, or is this some other, like, motorcade? It's a motorcade of some sort. Some head of state is in town to identify that flag. Okay, we were talking about trees before the motorcade came. Yeah, there's the yellow trees and the red one. And this is like another red one. I think this is a red oak, that's what I'm guessing. But uh, it has basically all of its leaves still. What's the day? December something? December 6th? Pretty sure that's an oak. Maybe. Let's go take a look at the tree that got hit by lightning, see how it's doing. It's uh, just over here. It's lost all its leaves, but I think it's still alive. So there's a squirrel going up the tree, a couple squirrels in the tree. It still has some leaves on it. This is the tree that got hit by lightning, uh, resulting in the death of uh, three or four people. Pretty sad day. Oh, sorry about that. SD card was getting full. But yeah, this is the tree that got hit by lightning, which resulted in the death of three people and one person getting away. You can still see the lightning scar down the side there. And over here, there's quite a few lightning scars where it just made this like rip down the bark. And then one up there, straight line down, zap. Oh, looks like the police have decided to show up at the Chamber of Commerce. It was starting to block traffic. So they're over there now, blocking traffic. <laughs> let's, uh, let's make our way back around into Foggy Bottom and see what we can see. I was gonna take you to the Christmas trees, but it's kind of a gross day, and the Christmas trees don't really look that good. They look better at night. So we're gonna come out at night, one night on my way home from Copenhagen and go back to the country. We'll stop at the Christmas trees and I'll show you them all lit up. Oh, someone's doing a press report on an iPhone. Oh, protest. Uh, put it up on their Instagram. That's the Uyghur protest. Everybody getting their photos.
So there's the Christmas ornaments floating in the pool. And there's a wreath on every window and one over the North Portico as well. Okay guys, so that's a Tuesday in Washington. I got my donuts, which is pretty cool. Um, no idea what's going on tomorrow. Uh, Biden gets back pretty late tonight. I'm not gonna watch the helicopter in the middle of the night. But uh, we're gonna go down to the mall, maybe check out a museum I haven't been to, and uh, well, just keep going around the city. Thanks for watching. We'll see you soon.